gentlemen, welcome back to another great episode of Keeping Up With Those Unfiddles, the Keeping Up With Those Unfiddles show edition. We'd like to welcome our special guest tonight, Darianis Miranda. <laughs> Gentlemen. <laughs> Anywho, Anywho, let's get back to our program. How are you tonight? Bien, you do? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. So, we have a couple of questions tonight for you, Ms. Dariani's Miranda. Is this thing going to work? Okay. So, how has COVID-19 affected... How has COVID-19 affected how you live before and how you do live now? So basically, how has your life changed after Corona? De todo. Um, how? Como más. Tú en momento. Tengo que usar mascarilla. I know. So people are starting to say that masks are becoming a thing. They're becoming uh, a part of our basic fashion and our show. And what we do today, everybody's wearing a mask. Everybody's wearing one. Masks are the great things. Everybody's wearing a mask. You know, masks are just, just another thing. So let's move on to our next topic, our school, how schooling and job has changed. You know, kids are doing schooling online these days and it's so much different to how they were doing it back in the day, <laughs> to how they were doing it back in the day. And even if they're going into in-person school, they're still, you know, it's still affecting them because they're wearing these masks, these, these kids in elementary school and middle school, they're not used to having these masks, but now they have to wear them. Yeah. They have to, you know? That's Layla and she. Yeah, Layla, do, do you want to come? Do you want to come say hi? Come say hi. Come here. So, stay right here. Stay right here. Just look at the camera right there. So, do you like school? Yeah. You do? Yeah. Okay, that's a bad example. Go sit down. Thank you so much. Okay, so I hear you're unemployed. How about that? <laughs> I was self-employed. No, 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 no. You're unemployed. Like, no oh, job. Oh, my God, no. You're not, you don't no. have a job right now? No. It's because of coronavirus. Because of coronavirus, right? Yeah. So she actually did lose her job because of coronavirus. So it's, it's very, very, um, it's very, very bad. We don't like the Chinese virus. Go back to China. China will pay for what they've done. So let's move on to our next topic. Politics. Politics. Donald Trump. Donald John Trump. Trump 2020, Trump train, Trump right? Trump 2020. Yes, Trump 2020. 2020. Yes, Layla, scream it, scream it. Trump 2020. All right. <coughs> Anywho, coronavirus. Anywho, so who are you voting for this year? JJ. JJ? Who's JJ? Donald Trump. Okay, so TJ, we. TJ, TJ. What is it? <laughs> Anywho, moving on to the next topic. So let's talk about the vice presidential debate that happened last night between Kamala Harris, Kamala Harris, and um. I don't saw that. I don't see it. You didn't see it. No, I forgot. Oh well, that was that was very bad, I, was, I guess. So I feel like um, some uh, some news, but what she well, is, what Kamala Harris was lying the whole time. She was no, lying. I, the thing I saw on the news was. Like, she say something like a, like a woman, I just want to decide about her body. I, yes, and that, that's called being pro, pro-choice, yeah, right? Mm -hmm. And allowing abortion. Yeah. Which, let's go yeah. ahead out on the limb and say that they shouldn't, they should be allowed to a certain extent, right? Right? Mm -hmm. They should be allowed to a certain extent. But imagine, because a baby, I mean, he I was one. Okay, I can't he, Okay, understand. but imagine this, your son. He was... A nine-week-old baby. He was a one-week-old baby. He was a one-day-old baby or fetus in your um, uterus. Mm -hmm. So he is yeah, now he is now a two-year-old. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Who has a healthy life? Who who has a sister and a mother and a father? But if the, at that two-week where his heart wasn't beating yet, 
you would have unplugged him or you would have aborted him, he wouldn't be here today and he wouldn't have the life he does. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right? And that's, that's just a very close example of um, why abortions shouldn't be how they are and as common as they are. So... I mean, I'm not agree with abortion, but at the same time, if something happened with a woman, like, you know, sometimes like young ladies, like a relation or something like that, they can decide, I mean, they can decide about the body or like, in the case, I don't know how I can say, um, like in that cases, something like, like any law or anything, you know, to help when it's a violation in women. Okay, you know? but here's, here's the thing, here's the thing, listen to this. As soon as you have your baby in a hospital, they, if you don't want to keep it, there's so many people who want babies. So many people who are willing to adopt. Um, yeah, but at the same time, if, you know, it's a, when relation happen a woman or so, uh, kid oh. or something, that's difficult and they can be a trauma for that person. Okay, you I know? understand so, that. But listen to this. It's, it's legal and it's a woman's choice to mm -hmm. abort her baby. But if someone I mean, kills, no no, 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 I get it, I get it. But if someone, like, you know, if some, let's say you were pregnant, right? Mm -hmm. And someone comes and kills you, it's double homicide. Two people, right? Yeah. But you can go and kill the baby, and there's no problem with that. But as soon as you go and kill the mother and the baby, then that's a double homicide. So when you want to kill the baby, it's completely fine. But when you don't want to kill the baby, then that's when there's a problem. Yeah, yeah. Which it shouldn't be. You're still you killing it. To prevent You're still killing it either way. So my thing is, if you're, if you're, if you can kill it and it's double homicide, then, you know, why allow, why, why allow for the baby to get killed by your choice instead of by someone else's choice? At the end of the day, the baby's getting killed, right? So why should it be a double homicide if you're allowed to abort a baby? You know? But any whom, thanks for joining us tonight. time to prevent low battery. So, thank you for joining us tonight. Bye. See you guys. You have, you have a good one. Oh, it's already over. Yeah.